Welcome to the YouTube channel of Legal Aid Trust. This video is one of the series of educational videos that will be available on this channel under the category General Awareness. Hey friends, in today's video, we are going to talk about conspiracy in torts. There are two types of conspiracies, criminal conspiracy and civil conspiracy. But in today's video, we will just talk about civil conspiracy. In the famous case of Quinn vs. Leatham, Lord Brampton gave the most famous definition of civil conspiracy. It said that a conspiracy is an unlawful association of two or more than two persons to do any act which is not legal according to the law of land or to do something harmful towards another person or to carry out an act not in itself unlawful but by unlawful mean. Conspiracy can also be understood as a partnership between persons where they come together to commit or involve themselves in the planning of some act. Let's understand this concept using an illustration. Suppose there are three people, Mr. N, Mr. O and Mr. P. Now O and P undergo an agreement that clearly establishes that they are agreeing on the proposal to doing a fraudulent act towards Mr. N. In such a case, this can be said to be a kind of tort of conspiracy or civil conspiracy. Now, let us discuss the essentials of a civil conspiracy. There are three essentials of civil conspiracy. Intention, which means that there should be a common intention among all the people that are involved in the act. Second, combination. At least two or more people should be involved in the act. And third, overt act which means that some overt action must be done by the offenders. Now, let's talk about the types of conspiracy in torts. There are three different types of conspiracy in torts. General, which means that if people are forming an association with the intention of harming others, it will be called as a general conspiracy. Second, conspiracy to injure. Here, the sole purpose of the offenders is to injure or harm others. Third, unlawful means conspiracy. Here, there is an agreement between two or more parties where one of them agrees to use unlawful means against the petitioner. I hope you found this video informative. Thank you for watching. Hope the information contained in this video was useful to you. We look forward to each one of your support and cooperation in making this initiative a success. For more details about the trust, do visit us at www.legalaidtrust.in. Kindly subscribe this channel and click on the bell icon to get the latest updates about various law-related educational videos. Thank you for watching us and have a good day.